Okay, let's move on. Question number 12. We have a triangle. It's a right triangle. How do I know? There's a right angle over here. A little box here that says right triangle. Okay, now they gave you um, a one side, one angle, and they want you to find a missing side. Right. Uh, for this case, you need to use a Sokotoa, sine, cosine, or tangent. Right. For right triangles, it's a unique triangle we can use sine, cosine, and tangent to solve for a missing angle or missing side. Okay. Right. Um, what I normally tell people, try to remember these terms, Sokotoa. Okay. Oop, they're not equal. Uh, I just want to put dash separate them. The three. Okay, in this case, let's look at what side we have. The angle is 30 degrees. We have the side that is next to it, which is X, and that's going to be the adjacent side. Okay. And we have this side 24, which is the longest side of a triangle. That would be the hypotenuse. Hypotenuse is always the longest side of a right triangle. Okay. And the last side, which we don't need, but I'll tell you anyway, is opposite. But we don't need this. So we have adjacent hypotenuse. Which one do we use? Well, adjacent starts with A. Hypotenuse starts with H. So which one to A and H? Let's be cosine over here. Cosine has that A and has that H. So the C means cosine. Cosine is equal to adjacent over hypotenuse. Okay. Let me use this formula over here. Cosine of an angle, 30 degrees, is equal to adjacent, which we don't know, is x. Hypotenuse is 24, and we want to find out x. Well, to find out x, I need to move the 24 to the other side, so I can isolate the x. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to multiply this by 24 on both sides. This way the 24 will cancel on the right. We're left with x equals 24 times cosine 30. Alright, let's see what is that equivalent to. Take out my calculator. Cosine 30. Okay, before you press enter, make sure you click go on mode and see that it's on degrees if you're using half and calculator. In my case, see it's on radian. It wasn't highlighted on degrees, and you'll get a different answer if it's not in the right place. So press enter on degrees, so now it's highlighted. And I can quit. Press enter here. It'll give me the answer 20.78 which is approximately 21 okay. 20.78 approximately 21 choice 3 there you go